Moving sucks. It's always very stressful, especially if you're a homing pigeon. Those guys get used to one location and think it's theirs. Correct, it's actually her place. She just allowed me to live there, you know, pay all the bills, feed her, clean her poop. I'm so grateful. Pigeons do get used to one home and they are actually very territorial birds. And that goes for all breeds of pigeons. Like, if a pair of ferals thinks your balcony is theirs, they will be fighting other pigeons away. With that being said, they also understand the common areas. That's why they don't kill each other in their feeding spots and seem to be okay with one another when they're just chilling somewhere all together. Pigeons are very smart birds. For the past two years, I happened to move two times. First time when Toby was about one and a half years old and now recently when she was about to be three. The first time we moved, I noticed a strange behavior. She would be trying to jump out of the glass window and that was happening time to time for literally months. She has never done that in the old place, so to me, she clearly wanted to fly home and that was heartbreaking to see. You can't tell your pet, like, it's not a big deal, we just move. What would a normal person do in my situation? That's right, I got another pigeon thinking, Toby probably just needs a buddy, cause pigeons live in flocks, they definitely love one another, cause they are pigeons, what can go wrong? Toby and I lived in the old new place for about three months when I got Bonnie and guess what? She was still trying to fly out of the glass window, but now, on top of that, she would occasionally try to kill Bonnie. Because they are actually very territorial birds. I had to add new shelves and new perches that weren't there before I got new member tower a little flock, so that Toby wouldn't think it's her stuff, and Bonnie would have a chance to claim those new stuff as her, so that Toby wouldn't fight her. And yet, they were still bickering all the time, when there was plenty of room for both of them to live a comfortable life. I mean, I mean, sometimes it was funny watching them be like, you know, you. Especially when Toby would start chasing Bonnie out. <laughs> it was funny uh, until it wasn't. Toby would pluck feathers off of Bonnie. It's a problem. It's very dangerous. The interesting thing about Toby is that she absolutely knew that she was not supposed to eat the new addition to the family. That's why she would be showing me that she doesn't like that thing, whatever that is, when I was standing right next to them. But as soon as I would turn around, she would attack. Eventually, half a year later, Toby started to somewhat tolerate Bonnie and her attempts to fly out of the window stopped. That place finally started to be home. Remember how I was thinking that Maybe her attempts to fly away were connected to the fact that she was the only bird? Well, now the three of us moved. Toby once again wants to fly out of the window, while Bonnie is kind of okay. She's an oriental frill. Homing pigeons do get used to one location and it's very difficult for them to adjust to the new place and start calling it home. To be honest, this is where them and I are very similar. But you know what? There was a positive change after moving. This is a new place for all of us. Toby doesn't think it's hers, yet. I made sure that every time I come over here, I would bring both of them with me together. Yes, it was very scary at first. Everything is new, big and empty. The floor is like the scariest of it all, but I got used to it pretty quick. My birds though, yeah. But that was a great bonding exercise. Now my birds don't try to kill each other, well, for the most part. Look. They even started to explore stuff together and they look friendly to one another. So are they now mates? No. Are they like friends? No. But now they have flock rules in our new place. We have the common area where everyone is free to go and this is their individual shelves that they are very protective of. And this is my nest. I keep the seat warm with my butt for the most part of the day. Even though it's nice here and we have more room, it will still take time for my home and pigeon to start feeling at home in our new place. Well, it will take all of us time.